So I was trying to hone in on your energy, Leo, and I was feeling um, some major shift or big change is coming your way. And I do feel like it's something that is going to make you very happy, um, something that you want, something that is welcomed. Um, this change also hearing that song for you by Tom Petty. Don't do me like that. Um, look up the lyrics to that song. I feel like this is going to have a lot to do with the situation here. All right, let's get into it and find out. So your overall energy, we have loyal heart. So that long term loyalty, uh, no drama, backstabbing or, you know, yeah yeah breathe and imagine this is something you're manifesting so it is it's welcomed it's something that you want um something you're envisioning fantasizing about daydreaming about something that you really want that's going to give you some kind of a new life wow it's a it's gonna be a change it's not gonna be what you're used to it's something like mind blowing, I feel like um, you could get a lot of attention or people looking up to you, holding you in high regard. Um, you may have a lot of choices or options or uh, something like that, but it's something you want. All right. Let's see your person's overall energy. What's going on? Leo's person's overall energy. We have here and now and TikTok. All right, so something in divine timing or need time takes time, time and cycles, time to heal, uh, divine timing, and here and now. So your person could have been stuck maybe in another situation or just stuck in not knowing, like, do I go back to the past? Do I go towards the future? Or in the process of releasing things of the past to look for the future or towards the future. Um, there is an egg in this picture with a door, which is usually like a door of opportunity to a whole new beginning here. So I feel like your person is, it's almost like the universe is trying to get this together like you're both manifesting this right but there's something snagging your person here there's something more about divine timing on their end um <laughs> we have yin yeah that loving caring nurturing compassionate energy um and soulmates and treasure island all right so it's like you see the value in this and they see your worth, your value. There's a loving, caring energy here. Wow, this is awesome. All right, Leo, let's get into it. Your person's current energies. What is going on? Current energies. Leo, keep in mind, when I say your person's energies, it could be yours. So feel free to flip-flop and reverse it as you see fit. But don't force anything, okay? All right. Yeah. Your person is manifesting. <laughs> just as you are, all right? Some kind of long-term commitment here, but there's something to do with waiting or they have their walls up or um, they're willing to fight for this, but there's something to do with timing or waiting. Or like your person has been through it, so there's like they're trying to heal. All right, we have the, the Nine of Wands, Wounded Warrior, Three of Wands, the High Priest, and then the Magician. Let's see, what else? What else is going on with Leo's person? Current energies, please. Wow, Four of Wands, next level of commitment. 1111, Make a Wish, Twin Flame, Soulmate, A Reason to Celebrate, House of wow, Ten of Pentacles. That's that long-term loyalty, loyal heart that you, you have. Could be a blending of families or moving in together, starting a family, next level of commitment or recommitment if this is someone coming back from the past. But wow, wow. Yeah, things are going to move forward here, Leo. What else? What else? Current energies. What else is going on? 
Six of Wands, victory and success. I feel like this person holds you in high regard. They see your value. They see your worth. They see what this could be. They feel that soulmate bond. They feel that connection here. They may actually give you a lot of attention and praise. Wow. All right. What's blocking this? What's blocking this connection? All right. It could be you with options. Leo, Leo, do you have other options? <laughs> we have the sun. That is your energy, Leo energy. It's the happiest card in the deck. Uh, seven of cups, options, confusions, and two of pentacles juggling. And I'm saying you because... Your energy came out with it. Are you unsure? Because this person wasn't 100% in. So like, are you on the fence? Or were they juggling? Or were, did they have other options or confusion going on? I felt like there was stuck energy with your person here. But they're, it's like they're becoming unstuck is what I was seeing, but let's see, what else is blocking this? It did kind of come out in the reverse. Someone could have had a heartbreak pain from the past, so it doesn't necessarily mean you, it's just like they're healing from that. So they have some fear about moving forward because they don't want to get hurt again. Or this could be you. Maybe this person hurt you and you're piecing out and going after a whole new life that you're trying to manifest, all right? So place that where you see fit, but what else? Blockages, what else is blocking this? All right, the lovers, Gemini energy, the moon, Pisces, Cancer energy, and 10 of wands, the burden. Somebody's got a choice in love and doesn't know what to do, or it's unknown yet. This connection is very strong. I mean, it's, it is a strong, very strong connection. I just feel like maybe the timing wasn't right or isn't right. Your person wants long-term victory and success higher level of commitment here. Your person wants that. The blockages, I don't know if it's you or them, but there's a burden. There's a choice that needs to be made. There's heartache, pain. There's juggling. There's confusion. There's should I, shouldn't I? Will I, won't I? Um, going back and forth with thoughts um, and still just kind of being left in the dark or feeling some kind of confusion here. Um, let's see, how does this person truly feel about you, Leo? How do they truly feel about you? Seven of Pentacles. I feel like either they've already started planting seeds with you or they want to. All right. Um, Six of Pentacles. Equal give and take, reciprocity. If you, Leo, are the one that has somebody that needs to, like, disconnect from that, they could see you as giving to two. But if not, it's like there's equal give and take. Like, you guys work well together. You understand each other. You have what they lack, they vice versa. And you guys do, you both put in the same amount of work and effort here. It's equal. Um, the High Priestess and then the Two of Cups. For some of you, I'm getting like this could be a secret admirer or somebody you don't quite know yet. For some of you. For others of you, I feel like this person really, really, really follows their intuition and knows that you are their soulmate. Soulmate. But it's, there's things hidden still or it hasn't been spoken yet or communicated yet. 
How else do they feel? Oh. Yeah, the Tower of Scorpionic Energy. There could have been shock shocking sudden news that came in and came crumbling down here with that tower. Knight of Swords, Gemini Energy, Seven of Swords. With someone being like in and out, wishy-washy, love bombing, sneaky, manipulative. I don't like that energy. There is a tower moment here because of this. Some kind of sneaky energy. Actions not matching words, manipulation, sneaky behavior. Ugh, could have been a third party situation. For some of you, they could have thought the grass was greener. On the other side and it wasn't and now it's like i want to come back i'm willing to fight for this that's what i'm getting they're willing to fight for this because they want the commitment back they want the relationship back they thought the grass was greener uh, like they just they just did they just did thought the grass was greener so you may be trying to manifest a whole new life with somebody else. I don't know. You guys are going to have to let me know. I'm getting a couple different storylines going on here. Like either this was like a strong commitment, marriage even, or living together or something. And this person stepped out and screwed up and got themselves stuck in a situation or something and now wants to come back to you. Or this could be someone new that you don't know that feels like they can have victory and success and all of that with you, but there's other stuff that's in the way that they're trying to heal or you're trying to heal or whatever. All right, well, let's see. What's the potential outcome here for Leo? Keep in mind, Leo, that you have free will and so do they so you can change your mind and so can they and i'm not here to tell you what to do so use your own discernment all right so we have five of wands page of swords oh someone's gonna find something out here there's either gonna be a heated passionate argument dispute drama too many people involved competition Page of Swords, it could come through a message, a text message, a phone picture, something I feel like might come to light. Oh, oh Leo, Leo, what is this? What's going on? Tower moment could be caused by a virgo or an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn scorpionic energy with the tower so i feel like the outcome there's going to be something coming to light some shocking news sudden event things come crumbling down or that's what you just went through all right um something's something's gonna come to light It's going to be a, a fight, drama, an argument, and I feel like there's other people involved here. And then it's going to need to take some time to calm down. What else? Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Seven of Swords again. Six of Wands. I need to just give you guys a warning. Watch out. There's like a snake in the grass here. I feel like it's someone from the past. It could be an ex. Your ex, their ex. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, a water sign. It could even be a mother, sister, a parent. That's, I feel like they're trying. 
to screw this up intentionally. Some a third party, somebody else is trying to screw this up. They don't either want you guys to be together. They don't want to see you with them. There's like jealousy, possessiveness, unstable emotions, sneaky behavior, manipulation. Someone doesn't want this together. Someone's trying to stop this or get in the way. And that's what this fight is going to be. And that could be what these tower moments are. Could be a cancer sign, you guys. Could be anybody, but for some of you, or with strong cancer placements. All right, what else for the outcome here for Leo? That's a lot. Yeah, shit. Uh, you may hold back. Leo, I feel like you may have, uh, like, hold back. Somebody is stabbing you in the back here. It's, it's someone toxic. It's someone with either, like, extreme jealousy issues, toxic ways. You're, you're walking away from this. You're trying to be the bigger person here and walk away and start a whole new chapter and become just independent loving yourself like just doing you there could be an air sign here too aquarius libra gemini and cancer is coming in hot the cancer sign an aquarius it could just be air energy aquarius libra gemini of just cutting off and cutting out things that no longer serve you and moving forward, like speaking your truth, you know, standing your ground, speaking your truth, walking away with dignity, honesty, and just moving forward. There could be something unfair about a vehicle or a car for some of you. <laughs> something going on with a car or a vehicle. I don't know. But you're holding back on this. This is a soulmate. You're holding back, though. You might be getting communication from uh, Capricorn, possibly Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, predominant. Ooh. Mm, you may have another soulmate coming towards you, and that's what's going to give this new life. Could be an Earth sign, or it could be an Aries or Gemini. Could be anybody, though. You're going to get communication from an emperor, male or female, doesn't matter. But somebody who's got very strong, dominant, boss-like energy, long-term, queen of pentacles. It's, it's, it'll be stable, grounded, long-term, strong. There's a, there's a choice, though. There's a choice. I feel like this is you. You have to make this choice. You're going to get some kind of communication coming in. You're walking away, I think, from this. So this could be like a marriage that you're walking away from or a higher level of commitment. There was too much. Some, there's something hurtful that went on here. Painful, backstabbing, betrayal, deception. You're going to take a leap of faith into this new, new direction. That's this new life. And, yep, so loyal heart, imagine, breathe. You're manifesting this new start here, this new life. Yep. So I think you're going to walk away from this person that you, you did build a life with or started to anyway or thought you were going to or they thought they were going to with you. But they had some confusion as well where they were stuck. So, whew. Yeah, I see whoever this other person is, like, they're going to give you that ultimate happiness. You're going to be happy. All right, uh, let's see what's the biggest obstacle experiencing. So 
this may hurt. It may be an experience. It may be something that you're never going to forget, like a lesson or something learned here. All right, past lives. That's why it's a freaking karmic. You spent past lives with this person and there was a there was karma to be filled here. Projections. Yeah. So there could have been a lot of projections on each other. Like you did this, I did that, you know, like pointing the finger or this person projected a lot of their insecurities, their lacks, their, you know, things like that onto you. Like it's your fault, the rebel um, and then stress. So overcoming the stress of all of this. Um, this person could have been a little bit of a rebel or you could have been, um, or the snake or whoever this other person is like overcoming that. All right. Um, what else do we have for Leo? Leo, what do we got? Messages for Leo. Unawakened. Unaware, 3D ego, darkness, your twin flame is not ready yet. Regret, remorse, life regrets, loss, start making empowered choices and creativity. Inspiration, productivity, creation, bring out the greatness within. Yep, and then look, romance, rebel, flow, savor, entice. Open yourself to romance, this new person. All right, ask yourself a question. I'll tell you the answer. Ready? No, the answer is no. And potential, fulfillment, risk, achievement, your potential is limitless. This new person, I feel it is awesome. Um, might come to you in summertime or spring. A um, couple months, I think, would be uh, safe to say. In a couple months, you might start seeing this new person coming around or this decision that you have to make. So, But you're manifesting this, Leo. This is something you want, all right? It is a new life. It's a new, new chapter here for you. Um, let me get some other messages, Leo. Anything else for Leo? Thank you. Photograph, looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, make new memories. Boat, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, and closure issues. So you're going to be moving on from this. Not today, not dealing hurt, avoiding conversation, still angry. And then look, talking, interested, conversing more, awaited message arrives, call, text, email. Yeah. Cupid's arrow and healthy choices and paradise, twin flames and passion. Wow, this is what you have coming towards you. Healthy choices. Because you're doing this, because you're making healthy choices in love and life, self-love, self-care, and being happier, Cupid's arrow is delivering. So have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting. Um, you may have a little hesitation over it. Don't, all right? Because I feel like that's this person that you are going to choose. Um, paradise, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other, twin flame, yin, yang, zen, balance, union, duality, coupling, complementing each other, and passion, insane chemistry, like each other equally, and having fun. This new person is your person. This old person, no. The, the damage is too much. The damage went way too far, I feel like. Or... Whoever this outside party is that keeps sticking their whatever body parts, nose or what else, <laughs> into this is it's screwing it all up. So I don't know, Leo. I do see a happy outcome for you, though. All right. Um, so that is what I have.